Hello, hello, Bob. I wanted to give you a little bit of a video. I'll make it quick. I know you uh, wanted to see it. So it's right almost pretty much at the corner now that I'm seeing it. There's one house that kind of sits cat a corner from this house, from that corner to the other corner. And as you take the turn, because this is the turn here, this is the beginning of 535 Gagger. Hold on, let me get out of the. I wore the perfect flip flops. <laughs> There's no homes. Excuse me. There's no homes completely on one side at all. And then there's just that one house directly that kind of corners both corners. And then this would be Gagger. So you have um, a little bit more. You, you have almost pretty much a quarter of an acre. A quarter of an acre. You have definitely, I know, space was important to you. So I want to show you the distance between you and your neighbor, which is a good amount of space. So your lot line with and theirs and theirs goes all the way over. So you definitely have very good space in between you guys. Okay. Show you what the front of the house looks like as well. You can kind of see. Ooh. This dirt and my sandals are not working today, but <laughs> you can kind of see what the front looks like here. Nice two car garage. It has a very beautiful entryway with the pillars. I love that about it. So it's still working on plumbing and things like that nature. So the grass isn't here yet. Obviously it's a April completion date. So you still have a little bit more time to get all the nooks and crannies out. Nice open door. You can see through it, which is always beautiful. You can see directly to the back. So. You have a nice walk-in coat closet here. Then that's your AC system here, but you also have some um, space on the side for storage. As you come in, this would be your formal living, well, your living room and your dining room area would be right here. I'm not sure if the electricity works. Yet, maybe not. I don't think so. Nothing just came on. But this would be your kitchen. White 42 inch shaker cabinets, granite uh, quartz countertops. Beautiful light fixtures here and throughout. The vinyl floor planking throughout the house. So that's always awesome because there's no carpet. You don't have to worry about that. And turn down here. Nice size bedroom. All the uh, closets do have the double French doors for the closets. Nice style closet here. If you go down, again, quartz in the bathroom. Beautiful light fixtures and towel up. Okay. This bathroom also has a nice size linen closet inside. A nice heavy duty um, tub in this one. Okay. We got bedroom two and three. So two. Nice size room here. This one be front facing. Um, again, they all have the uh, double French doors on the closet. They just need to be painted. But nice amount of natural light, as you can see. Obviously, there's no um, lights working, so it's 
good natural lighting in the house. This is the smallest of all the rooms. Okay. This would be a nice office or a nice guest room. Again, front facing with the double doors. You do have that split floor plan. So the three bedrooms on this side, you have a huge living room and a nice dining room set up. You could totally screen in your back area if you wanted to. Nice open backyard area. As you can see, next to neighbors have a pool. You could totally do that if you wanted to. It goes all the way back. Pretty quiet. It does have some greenery because you do have, um, not super busy, but it is a, a busier road behind you. But for it being five o'clock in the afternoon, it's pretty quiet. You could definitely screen this in. Okay. Come on in. Then you have your master. Nice size master. Beautiful tray ceilings in the bedroom. You have your um, door that will enter into your full bathroom your owner's bathroom with the double sinks, quartz countertops throughout the shaker cabinets. You yourself has a huge linen closet, nice ass linen closet there with a step down shower. Seamless step down shower with your toilet and a beautiful walk-in. Oh, I keep wanting to turn the lights on. A nice walk-in closet. Definitely beautiful size there. Okay, then we go through. We come back out. And I don't know what it is about me, but I love having um, the owner suite or the master bathroom bedroom next to the kitchen. Because I like a little late night snack. But <laughs> here goes the, the kitchen area. You do have a nice size pantry. Okay, you got your pantry. And then it goes through to your wash and dryer, where your wash and dryer hookup would be. You have an additional French doors where the wash and dryer is to either put more pantry items. Um, if you're like me and you love Amazon, you shop and buy all the gadgets, perfect amount of space for gadgets. If not, the laundry detergent, anything that you need for the laundry room area. You still have the um, space at the top as well, right above the laundry room. Then, probably won't be able to see here, maybe a little bit, but you got a full two car garage. A little extra amount of space back there. All right, so this is just a little, little look you see, kind of synopsis of kind of a little bit of everything about the house. And you let me know what you think. I would love to set an appointment and so you can see a little bit more for this beautiful home. Alrighty, see you soon.